This is my film. Are you kidding me? This is my fifth time or sixth trying to film this. Anyway, I've been gone for a long time, and false advertising has happened in your subscription. <clears throat> false advertising has happened in your subscription box. There we go. I got a sentence out. Anyway, I moved. Things have happened in my life. I'm human. I can't do things daily all the time. I broke my promise, I'm sorry. Um, I've been trying really hard to get into this swing of daily breads, but for now it might be weekly or monthly, and I'm really sorry about that. I really, really am, but I am extremely busy. Um, so yeah, you don't even wanna go through that, trust me. So uh, anyway, let's get into today's first. Today's verse is Ecclesiastes 7.20. So, it says, Not a single person on earth is always good and never sins. And that, my friend, is the truth from heaven. Uh-huh. So, dude, everybody has sinned. Seriously. Adam and Eve sinned. Abraham sinned. Noah sinned. Oh my goodness, that's crazy. I had no idea they sinned. Yes. They sin. The people before you sin. The people after you will sin. Yes, people sin. And they will continue to sin. But the great thing is, God, God died on the cross to save them from their sins. So now they can still go to heaven and God still loves them just the same. And so if you're thinking, oh my goodness, God doesn't love me as much because I sin so much. God's like... I died for you. I died for you. I died for you, child. You are my child. I died for you. You are no longer a slave. I died for you. He's trying to tell you. He died for you. And why did he die for you? He died for you to save you from, their, from your sins. Yes, you still sin, but you are saved from them. Okay? God died for you. He, did, he died because he loved you, people. He loved you. <laughs> so, the thing is, you really have no place to think that God doesn't love you because you sin more or you sin because, you know what? You don't know that you sin more. You don't know if you sin less. The fact is that you sin and God died to save you from your sins and God loves you. And you know what he does with your sins? He forgets about them. He forgets about him. They go completely out of his mind and they go walk right over to the sea of forgetfulness and they take a dive and they don't make it out. That's what happens to your sins, okay? They get cast in the sea of forgetfulness. So, just know everybody has sinned and God died for you. God died for everybody and he doesn't care if you sinned or not because he already saved you from your sin. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that and that you have a great rest of your day and that you have a blessed day and that God just encounters you in so many new ways. God bless you. Bye.